Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm here with my friend Lily and we are going to be doing a video where we try Japanese food that we bought from a store called Daiso. <laughs> Let's get started. Let's get into it. Let's go. Let's begin. Vamos. Come on, vamonos. Everybody, <laughs> let's go. Come on, let's get, get to it. it. I know that we can do it. <laughs> Where are we going? Why do you know that? <laughs> what are we going to start with? Cubits. 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 Okay, so we have some cubits. They look like They're little like... chocolate wafers. It says, description, wafer, product name, a wafer with chocolate flavored filling. I feel like this should be switched. You should open it. <laughs> It smells chocolate. It smells like cocoa powder. Oh, it does. Really strong, too. That looks weird. Okay, ready? <laughs> One, two, three. I mean, it's pretty good. Not bad. It's just like a wafer of chocolate. <laughs> yep. What do we rate it out of five? Um, probably like four. Yeah. <laughs> four. I could keep eating them. Yeah. Next, we have these. Ramen chips. Ramen Crunch is a crunchy and delicious Japanese style ramen noodle snack cracker. Oh. I really hope it's so like much ramen. There's so much air in these that you can't even just rip, rip it. Okay. <laughs> it's like it just deflated so much. <laughs> you think it's all full, but it's just... Yeah. Oh, this does not look good. <laughs> it smells gross too. Um I was expecting this to be a lot different. Right. Cheers. Oh, I don't want two of them. Cheers. They're good. Oh my gosh. They look gross, but they taste good. They're so good. I want another one. Okay, next step. This is bean jelly. And I'm guessing that's kind of like jelly beans without the sugary part. Well, they put bean paste in mochi, and it's supposed to be sweet. Oh. So. Hopefully this is sweet too. Yeah. And not disgusting. I'm guessing the flavors are They say them. Somewhere. Be no wait. Red bean, plum, red radish. What's the other one? Salt? One is flavored salt. That's concerning. Oh, can I have the pink one? You can try the pink one first. Ew! Ew, it's wet! Ew! <laughs> this is disgust. I'm not excited. <laughs> It doesn't have a smell. I mean, it's not bad, but I don't like it. It might not really taste like anything. Uh, it has a texture of beans. Oh, now that I think about it. Oh, uh, no, I don't like that. Wait, try I this can't one. even tell what flavor that is. Oh, I took a huge bite. <laughs> you took a little <laughs> nibble. I'm sorry that I didn't want to, like, die. <laughs> Mine's better, though. That one's better than this one. It has less flavor in them this one. I can't get past the bean texture. This one has a more bean texture, I think. Because that one's more like gooey. I don't even know if I want to try it. We have to. Oh, no. Where do we Oh, it's so bad. Having a struggle. I feel like blue is like blueberry and purple is like purple. I feel like purple is definitely. I don't like these. This one doesn't smell like anything either. It tastes the same. Oh this one doesn't. Ugh. So I kind of stopped working as we started opening these, but we are trying this salt tomato candy. It says it's sugar syrup, which is made of corn, potato, and sweet potato, salt, concentrated tomato, tomato flavor, and vegetable juice. How does sweet potato, potato, and corn make tomato? <laughs> make syrup. No, that's what's in the syrup. That's so weird. Ooh, okay. They're individually wrapped little red packets. I just can't get it out because it's like stuck inside. <laughs> okay. I don't like it. I don't like it either. It just tastes like tomato. Like you're eating cherry tomatoes? You expect it to be like nice because it's a candy, but it's just like not. I don't want for nothing. Cool. Also, why is it like clear? Like it's not. I thought it would be more red in color. Yeah. But it, it looks wasn't. like it would be good, but it's not. Alas. It does not. I give it like a <laughs> 1.5 or 2 because yeah. I really didn't like the bean juice. I think like a 1 because the bean jelly was, was zero. 
Next, we're gonna try this milkshake candy chocolate. It's called Milkita. When you try this flavor of indulgence, sweet memories of sipping a chocolate shake will flow through your senses, and you can enjoy without guilt because each candy is made with real milk. This sounds good. I'm, I think this might be good. They're individually wrapped as well. It smells like a Tootsie Roll, and I don't like Tootsie Rolls. It does. It smells exactly like a Tootsie Roll. I don't like Tootsie Rolls. I think they're alright. We don't have Tootsie Rolls in New Zealand. It tastes like a Tootsie Roll. Yeah. It's literally a Tootsie Roll. Not a fan of Tootsie Rolls. I like them. I'd give it a 4. See, I give it like a 2. <laughs> Maybe a 1.5 with the tomato. I really don't like Tootsie Rolls. I want more of these. They're really good. Yeah. So lead my milkshake. Sucks for you. Okay. We have hot chili chips with seaweed, sugar candy, or our marble drinks. Do you want to do some sugar candy? Maybe. Let's do it. I think it's I'm excited for. I'm guessing it's going to be like crunchy bars, like New Zealand, like honeycomb kind of thing. The ingredients are coarse sugar, granulated sugar, and baking soda. So it seems like it's exactly like cookie pokey. But it says that you pronounce it like karume. 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 I took Japanese for one year, so that Me means too. I know nothing. Same. <laughs> and I know how to say itadakima, which I'm pretty sure is like when you eat. So I know how to say sugar. It's satu. Oh, itadakima. So. Satu. We're just eating sugar. That's what's happening right now. It smells like maple sugar candy. <laughs> it smells like hokey pokey. I think I'm gonna like this. It smells like hokey pokey. Yeah. It tastes like stale hokey pokey. Tastes like stale maple sugar candy. I give it a four. Yeah. If it's crunchier, maybe a five. See, I want it to be like not as crunchy. It's like chewy. Mm -hmm. Yeah, chewy as well. That would be good. See, yeah. I've tried these before. Have you tried that one though? No, and I can't open it. We have these marble drinks, and it says you remove the plastic from the top, and you push a marble in, and the marble. You push a marble. It doesn't yeah. have a marble in it. You push it in, and oh. that's what makes it carbonated. Oh, like you like push it, this in, and the marble falls in there. And it makes it carbonated? I don't know, it's really weird, but it's cool. Yeah. Can you do this? I mean, I can like... One thing just... Oh! <laughs> it was really hard to do it. Ah! Oh! <laughs> Is it fizzing too much? No. Ah. It just starts fizzing. You gotta press hard. <laughs> Press hard, Dina. Go, go, go. <laughs> See, it carbonates. I mean, it's not bad. It's not bad. I don't really like it that much. It kind of tastes like bubble gum lemonade. See what I mean? I don't like this one. I don't like artificial strawberry, so this one's like a two. Oh. Not a that one's like a four. It tastes like you've put a strawberry hard candy in some soda water. This one, and this one partially reminds me of memories from going to San Francisco. So. <laughs> Those are really hard to drink out of. Mm -hmm. The last thing we have is hot chili with seaweed. I feel like it's not going to be that chips. bad, but I'm like, I'm excited about these actually. So yeah. I think it'll be really good. They look good. They smell like something I've had before. They don't smell like too intense or anything. Tastes like there's ketchup on it. <laughs> Like seaweed sheets with flavoring on them. Yeah, I mean, I like seaweed, so it's like not bad, but it's not like great either. I'm not a huge fan of seaweed. They're just really mediocre. Yeah. I would really give them like a 2.5. Yeah. Not bad. I'm gonna give them a 2.75 because I like seaweed. Wow, yay! <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I think that's everything mm -hmm. that we bought to try. The best was definitely the ramen chips. They look really weird and like threatening. And these were good too. These aren't, yeah. they weren't like the best thing ever, but they were still good. I mean, but those, they're really good. They're super good. All right, that is all we have for this video. Thank you so much for watching. If you'd like to follow Lily on Instagram, I will put it down here. It is Stargazer Lily. <laughs> Try and make it go up in my head somehow. Make sure to like and subscribe for more videos. And if you have any questions, make sure you leave them in the comments below or you can contact me on my social medias they are all deanna Haley. thank you for watching and i'll see you guys next time bye <laughs> all about american school so this video has been requested i think three or four times how do you feel about the bean i feel bean like jelly. it's okay i feel like you're overreacting a little bit <laughs> you don't think it tastes like bean texture
It tastes like mochi, which oh. has that. bean paste in it, so. Is that really? Yeah, it has bean That's paste. That's why. Oh. See, I like mochi, because I think it tastes good. <laughs>